All right. Let's bring in our module of the week guru, Martin Anderson Klutz, a senior solutions engineer at Acquia and a maintainer of a number number of Drupal modules of his own. Ma uh, Martin, what do you have for us this week? Thanks, John. Have you ever wanted to quickly search your Drupal admin UI for the specific page you need to get to? There's yes. a module for that. It's called the coffee module. And it was originally created in November of 2011 and was actually covered as module of the week on this podcast all the way back in episode number 45. It has uh, versions available as 8.x-1.3, which works with Drupal 9 and 10, and it also has a 7.x-2.3 version. It has 53 issues open, only 13 of which are bugs against the 8.x branch, and it does have test coverage. The site is currently in use by almost 31,000 Drupal sites. And the maintainer is Michael Mole, who appears to have created the module in his first year on Drupal.org, now almost 13 years ago. So the module works with a simple keystroke to sort of invoke that search interface, uh, allowing you to immediately start your search. You can start uh, typing, and it will provide suggestions as soon as you start uh, typing in the first letters of where you're trying to get to. You can use the arrow keys to move between different suggestions to sort of quickly select uh, between different suggestions that it provides. Now, listeners who have used Mac apps like Alfred or Spotlight will be familiar with, uh, you know, the experience as being uh, pretty similar to that. And it just ends up being a really fast and simple way to move between different places in your uh, Drupal admin interface. Uh, it also has a uh, kind of a shortcut command, colon add is a quick way to add content of a specific type. And it additionally provides a hook that you can use to define your own commands as well. Also note there is a coffee extras module that you can use to add even more commands, but it doesn't work with Drupal 10 and is officially marked as no longer developed. As a final note, I will point out that the Gin admin theme comes with its own sort of built-in optimization and formatting for coffee, so you can enjoy Gin and coffee together. So let's talk about the coffee module. I don't, I don't suggest you enjoy Gin and coffee at the same time, except when using Drupal. That's just me. Um, I love the coffee module. I, uh, I think I, I use it on every site I build. Um, that's all. That's all I got. Coffee for the win. Uh, personally, it's it's not what I don't I don't know why either because I I typically do like shortcuts, but it's just one that I've never uh, it's never caught on for me. Um, I don't have any objections to it particularly. Um, like if like if I'm working on a project with John, for example, I have no problem with somebody adding it. Um, but if it's a project only I'm working on, it's you know. It's one of the modules that I remove just because I, I don't personally use it. Um, and it, it and it's an easy module to remove because it doesn't affect anything else, right? It's So I, I kind of like how it's really self-contained. And if it's helpful for some people, it, it works. But personally, I just kind of use the admin toolbar. I, I will say I did not realize you could do the colon add and, and add content that way. Um, that's super spiffy. Okay. Uh, yeah. What? Learn what? What do you, you got? No, I was gonna say learning about that might oh, be, all right. uh, might be worth checking it out though. The game changer. Does that work for like taxonomy too, or is it just content types? Do we know? The project page I've says content it. types, but yeah. Yeah. All right. Maybe somebody oh, can open a new that. feature request. Yeah. I know. I feel like if I could colon and add taxonomy, like, oh man, that would be <laughs> okay. Yeah, I have a feeling that actually might have been one of the things that was in Coffee Extras. So, you know. Hmm. Maybe the mention here will inspire somebody to jump in and take over that and bring it up to date. Awesome. Cool. All right. Just to just well, to really extend on the uh, the coffee thing here, you know, it it does everything it does because of great Java script. Wow, um, Andy, thank you uh, for that um, that bad joke. We appreciate that, and you are keeping the keeping the the dad jokes strong. Um, <laughs> listen, there's going to be a lot of talk about coffee. And as, as you can tell from my intro, I've had a couple of cups of coffee already today. So we're, we're doing just fine. Um, 
yeah, coffee is a great helper module. Uh, I think that, um, yeah, I think that everybody should use it, but, um, you know, it might not be for everybody anyway, Martin, thanks as always for a very topical and very useful module of the week.